Welcome back to the Supplier Approval Programs video series. I'm Jamie Miller, Registered SQF Consultant at Kellerman Consulting. Kellerman Consulting releases weekly training videos and important tips and strategies to help companies keep up to date with the latest food safety regulations. In the last episode, we discussed the review of documentation provided by suppliers and reassessment expectations of a supplier approval program. Depending on how responsive suppliers are in sending these documents, the approval process can be very time consuming. In this episode, we will discuss how different types of software solutions may be used to assist in document collection to efficiently and securely store documents. As long as your records are stored securely, maintained, and available for review, government regulators and auditors do not currently require a certain method of document collection and storage. Documents may be printed out as hard copies or stored electronically as long as they are organized for ease of use. There are many software solutions that make organization much simpler and aid in quick searches of the collected documents. Another benefit of supplier management software is in scheduling document requests, especially for documents that expire throughout the year. These may include non-GMO certificates, kosher certificates, halal certificates, sustainability certifications, and third-party audits such as GF GFSI certificates. These documents have expiration dates, so it's up to your facility to request an updated version upon expiration of the original document. Expired documents that occur throughout the year are one of the most common actions to be forgotten and cause concerns when identified during an audit. Having a program that automatically reminds your supplier as these documents expire is very helpful in keeping your QA team on top of document requests. Kellerman Consulting encourages our clients to investigate several solutions to find the best fit for their needs. Some of the most common software solutions are database programs, which allow suppliers to upload documents to a server that can be accessed by the facility completing the supplier approval assessments. The more advanced versions of these software systems can be programmed by the facility requesting the documents to communicate directly with suppliers to request specific documents and include prompts or questionnaires in place of uploaded documents so supplier reports can be generated in place of shared documents. These programs are generally used by the largest companies and may be cost prohibitive for smaller companies but are very helpful in achieving compliance to regulatory and certification standards with fewer people required to manage the system. Some of the most advanced programs offer a service to contact suppliers on your behalf, reducing your team's time commitment and achieving the goal of 100% supplier compliance. These services still require a person in the facility to verify that all the documents submitted are correct but the tricky part of obtaining the documents will be taken care of for you. Other solutions can include using CRMs to manage documents per suppliers. This is more cost effective, but far less desirable in terms of searching and updating documents. Although the price of supplier software solutions can be high, consider the cost of maintaining employees in your facility to perform these tasks. Oftentimes, use of a software can be a cost-saving solution in situations where the facility does not have the capacity to assign the responsibility of managing this program to an existing employee. We suggest that you dedicate time each year to track down documentation from suppliers for typical food and food packaging facilities. If this can fit into the work of a current department with the existing staff, software may not be the best solution. However, if an additional employee is required to be added to address documentation requests, software may be a viable option. Additionally, companies that operate higher level quality programs or programs where high risk documentation is utilized may consider protecting the system from lapses to be a worthy insurance measure even with the additional costs. 
Consider the risk out of control supplier documentation poses for your facility. Could it affect an audit outcome or even impact your facility's chances of passing an audit at all? For smaller companies, if a GFSI program is in place or if you are planning on implementing one, tight control of supplier documentation is required and any facility with these types of programs should strongly consider adding software to the system to assist in compliance. Most software companies offering supplier compliance solutions are able to conduct a demo and assist you to determine if they are a good match for your company. If you are interested in a software solution, we recommend contacting a few companies to better understand if they can help your facility maintain and support your supplier program. In our final episode of the Supplier Approval Program series, We'll discuss the Supplier Approval Program requirements and the major GFSI schemes. These GFSI schemes include SQF, BRCGS, FSSC 22000, and Primus GFS. To learn more, visit our website and you'll find a full library of food safety training videos and resources. You may also follow us on LinkedIn and click the bell to be notified of new resources as they are released each week.